How you doing? This is Vic from PersonalBrandMarketing.com. You can read three new marketing ideas every week at PersonalBrandMarketing.com, my blog. This idea is really great. I actually didn't come up with this idea, and I wish I had. Got balls? Well, these two women do. They're the founders of Sendaball.com. I actually learned about Sendaball.com while I was watching what has really become my favorite TV show right now called The Big Idea with Donnie Deutsch. It's an awesome show. You should watch it on CNBC. It's got the excitement of an infomercial, which coming from me is a compliment, and it's got a lot of substance and a lot of great inspiration for entrepreneurs and personal brand marketers of all varieties. So a couple of nights ago, these two wonderful women came on talking about their new company, making money, doing great stuff, and causing a buzz, a sensation. It's such a simple idea we can all implement, and you should definitely use sendaball.com, or you can do it yourself. What's the idea? Send a ball.com, of course, to somebody else. You're just mailing a ball to somebody. It's the neatest idea. So after watching the program, I want I went to their website, checked it out. I'm like, wow, this is a real company. So I found out that it costs 20 bucks to send a ball. I said, you know what, maybe that's worth my time, you know, in, in the inconvenience. But just let me see how much does it really cost. If, can I do this actually myself? So I went to my neighborhood dollar store. I got a ball for a dollar. I grabbed a Sharpie marker, wrote a to address, which was my own address, from, well, me. I am my own best friend, and then went to the post office. They didn't give me a hard time, but they were slightly confused in terms of what kind of parcel it was, is there a surcharge, etc., etc. It took a little finagling, but what was amazing, the line behind me, they were already buzzing about it. People had smiles, they were laughing, talking to one another. I ended up becoming the hit of that post office. There were about maybe 15 people there, all chattering about the fact that I'm sending a ball with just a stamp, no box, to somebody. It was all the rage, and I know it will be for your prospects and clients, too. It's so fun. We've all got balls. Who do you want to send it to? So, long story short, it cost me $1.47 to ship. It's a non-machinable parcel from the U.S. Postal Service which basically means they can't run it through their automatic system, so they have to charge me a surcharge. $1.47 ain't no thing. I could probably send uh, a manila envelope with a, a boring letter for the same amount. But you know what? This is a lot more interesting, a lot more engaging. Our direct mail, they consider that junk mail. They're going to chuck it. No one's throwing away your balls. People want to play with your balls. They're going to interact with your balls. They're throwing your balls around. And you know what? They're going to keep your balls around. If you got balls, you want to send balls. It took me eh, two days for, for uh, the ball to arrive to me. Perfectly safe and sound, of course. No big deal. I have a lot of fun now playing in my own office with my own balls. If you got balls, send balls. Check out personalbrandmarketing.com for even more great ideas. Again, this is Vic. I'll talk to you later.